I just discovered a dinosaur. Let's dig into this story. I set off from home sweet treehouse to the wilds of Wyoming for a board meeting with paleontologist Dr. Marcus Erickson. But along the way, I got lost. Whoa, this is wild. Hope I find Marcus soon. As the sun set, I finally saw something. Who's that? Hi. My name's Avani. <gasps> I'm Allison. It was Dr. Marcus's daughter, and she showed me to Paleo Camp, and I settled into my tent. Wow. The next morning, I went to meet Marcus. Hey, Allison. Oh, I made it. Oh. Need one of these. I dig it. Let's do it. And he put me to work, uncovering a triceratops that his daughter had found. She have a rib upper arm bone right here, and this one's part of the hip called the pubis. But it was time to join forces and put our thinking caps on. Where was the rest of it? I went pee and thought I saw something. Whoa! Was it a big rock? Or dinosaur? Oh my gosh, this is coconuts! I asked Marcus to come check it out. Cool, it's huge know. on this end, so that means yeah, it must be... a big bone. We started to gently uncover it. This is an amazing find you made, Allison. Woohoo! The preservation is getting really good as we go deeper into the hill. So we set to work in sweltering heat. Well, it is 9 o'clock at night here in Wyoming, and we are still digging. Look at this bone. It just keeps getting bigger. This is all we saw to begin with, and now it's as big as me. What do we got here? We have a triceratops femur, and that's the upper leg bone. It's pretty complete. Beautiful fossil. 65 million years old. Woohoo! How are we gonna get this thing out of here? Marcus got out a roll of toilet paper. Is this how the experts do it? Yep. And wrapped the entire bone and wet it. Plaster time. time. We are gonna put a cast around this bone. The same way you put a cast on a broken arm, and that is going to immobilize this bone. When we transport it, it's not gonna fall apart in our hands. Then after it dried, we gently rolled it over. First time this, this bone has rolled in 65 million years and it weighed about 65 million pounds. One, two, ah! How many miles? Just a couple miles. Here we go. No, woo! No, yep, no, we need reinforcement. Luckily, we had some friends come to our aid and carry it miles to the car. Well, I am T-Rexed, but what about you? <laughs> Can't try Sarah top this. Mission successful, off to the Science Center. So we are bringing our bone into the museum. Voila! Surprisingly, all dinosaur discoveries in the area are shipped off to fancy museums, but Marcus is committed to showcasing them locally to educate youth across eastern Wyoming. Marcus, this has been a true honor. I'm covered in plaster. Big thanks, and you are dynamite. Dynamite, sir. This is the life. I wouldn't have it any other way. So keep digging into your life. Keep going on adventures, because you never know what you might discover. Let the adventure continue.